Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to divide a positive integer by a negative integer. So a positive divided by a negative. Let's jump into number one where we have 18 divided by negative two. With this being a positive divided by a negative, we have different signs. This means our quotient, the answer to a division problem, will be negative. Just like when we multiply integers, different signs equal a negative answer. Let's think of this as 18 divided by two, which is nine. And this is going to be negative because again, we have different signs. Now division is the inverse or opposite of multiplication. So we can also think through this going the opposite way using multiplication. Let me rewrite our problem here. So we have 18 divided by negative two equals. So let's think how many groups of negative two or what times negative two equals that 18? Well, negative nine. Negative nine times negative two equals a positive 18. We need a negative times a negative to equal that positive 18. So again, just like multiplication, different signs equal a negative answer. Let's move on to number two where we have 24 divided by negative six. We have a positive and a negative. So we know our quotient will be negative because of those different signs. Let's think of this as 24 divided by six, which is four. And again, this is negative. So our final answer, negative four. Now we can also go the opposite way using multiplication. 24 divided by negative six equals. So how many groups of negative six or what times negative six equals that 24. Well, negative four. Negative four times negative six gives us that positive 24. A negative times a negative equals a positive. So there you have it. There's how you divide a positive integer by a negative integer. Remember, different signs, that's going to equal a negative quotient. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.